Going out for a drink in London usually means going out for a pint or a gin and tonic. But wine culture is alive and well in Great Britain, and the epicenter is at number 47 Villiers Street, near Charing Cross Station and the Embankment, not far from Trafalgar Square. This is Gordon's Wine Bar, established in 1890. It's believed to be the first wine bar in London. The owners proudly proclaim nothing has changed since the day it opened, nor will it. The atmosphere is absolutely amazing and absolutely original. Candlelit subterranean rooms look more like a warehouse because they were before it was a wine bar. In the 1860s, there was a wharf just outside the door. That changed in 1864 when the embankment was built to accommodate a new sewer system and eventually the tunnels for the underground. The embankment moved the river about 50 meters or 164 feet south. A nearby water gate marks where the river once flowed. Now it's wine that flows. The building above became a rooming house. Author Rudyard Kipling lived here for several years. Gordon's is incredibly popular. The dark cavernous rooms are cozy during cooler weather, and the outdoor seating on the Watergate Walk in the warmer months makes it a great gathering place. Gordon's menu includes many types of cheese, as well as traditional pies, salads, and tapas plates, and of course, wine, including sherry and port in large wooden casks. No beer here, no gin, but great wine, great reasonably priced food and great atmosphere.